Now, I'm going to tell you guys something I've kept to myself for years. None of you ever knew Adam Sessler. The last thing he said to me, Kristen, he said, Sometime when the college football 09 gameplay is up against it, and the AI are beating the boys, tell them to go out there and, with all they've got, win just one for the Sessler. Who doesn't love NCAA football? The pageantry, the atmosphere, the football action unsullied by professionals. But who would love NCAA football 09? 09 is more or less the same as 08, extremely familiar. Veterans will love the immense football action. He's got room to work. Rookies will love how user-friendly it all is. Anybody can get into this game, even if you went to USC. The biggest addition is the online dynasty mode. Ah, uh, the online dynasty mode. This is where you and a bunch of friends you've never met can play through dozens of college football seasons and try to recapture your college glory days, if you went to college. Once again, all this action is overseen by the holy trinity of Herb Street, Corso, and Nestler. I'm Brad Nestler. Is there nobody else that can call a college game? I'm Brad Nestler. With There's not a lot of defense in NCAA 09. It's really for the offensive-minded players out there. And quite honestly, with all the bodies hitting the floor, sometimes it's hard to know exactly what is going on. If you're a football purist, of course. Sadly, it has to be said that there are several bugs in the game. The roster customization has big glitches, lots of crashes and freezes. And the CPU sliders, the ones that are supposed to customize the AI, they do absolutely nothing. I see lots of patches in this game's future. It's a tough break for this team. NCAA Football 09 didn't raise the bar. It lowered it. We wish the animations were better, but we wish a lot of things. Maybe in NCAA Football 2010, they'll make some more substantial changes to the game. But until then, we give NCAA Football 09 two USC illegal boosters out of five.